Hey guys, it's Renee. So today I thought I would share with you how to make this fondant daisies decorations for cupcakes and cakes. I'm going to be using some fondant. The one that I'm using is the one by Wilton. I made a review on that one if you want to check it out. But to make them like even, I'm going to be working over a piece of wax paper using my roller with those like two green rings. I made a DIY on those and I use them so I can have like an even thickness all throughout my fondant. But then once I have my, uh, I'm going to be making three sizes of daisies. So I'm just going to show you how I do the whole thing with one size. I'm going to be taking this uh, piping tip 2A. This is by a local brand. I guess every brand is the same as far as uh, sizes go, but I'm going to be using that part. And I'm going to be cutting five circles. Then I'm going to make them balls like this. It's pretty easy and simple. I'm going to be taking this big dotting tool. I do have the DIY for this one, but I'm going to drag like my fondant from the top to the bottom like this, doing that with all my like five pieces. Then to make this a daisy, I'm just going to be um, using some water because with water, fondant gets sticky. I also colored some fondant in yellow, rolling it and then making it a bowl. And then once it's done, I'm going to place it on top and let it dry. So that's like the medium size. For my two other sizes, uh, it's going to be with this Wilton 12. The big ones are going to be with this part of like the piping tip, doing pretty much the same thing. But my tool that I'm going to be using to drag them is this. This is an eyeshadow. Um, well, I use this for eyeshadow. I don't know if it's really for eyeshadow, but I use the other side. That part makes an amazing dining tool. And then my smallest uh, daisies are going to be with like the other side of my piping tip, doing pretty much the same thing. And again, I'm going to be using this um, dotting tool, the big one, to drag them. I'm going to be using some green fondant that I previously colored. And I'm going to be using this two sizes of uh, leaf cookie cutters. I'm going to cut a few of them. Then I'm going to be working on the like details of them. Using this other dotting tool that I do have the DIY as well. And then I'm going to be using one of this like art palettes. I don't know how to call them, but they're pretty handy. I'm going to let my leaves dry in there so they can dry with a bit of an angle just to give them a more realistic kind of look and yeah this is pretty much what this daisies fun decorations look like they're honestly really easy to make handy to have and you can make a bunch of them ahead of time and just you know store them and to show you how they would look like on a cake I saved my last slice of cake just for you guys just so you could see what they look like on I think it looks better if you place them randomly and yeah play around with the sizes and all that stuff I think in an entire cake they would look amazing or in some cupcakes or some cookies as well but yeah um this kind of like reminds me of like Hello Kitty for some reason I don't know and I love Hello Kitty so I just love them hopefully you like them too if you did don't forget to give this video a thumbs up check out more decorations and toppers that I have on my channel and subscribe for more let me know what you think of this one and share it but yeah thank you so much for watching I'll talk to you later and take care bye